Hey, Jared, how are you? I'm pretty good. Thanks so much for having me. Appreciate it. Oh, thanks for calling in, man. It's good to talk to you, and uh, good to hear 30 Seconds to Mars back with some new music. We are back. It only took us four years, but we are back. I was just going to say, it doesn't seem like it's been four years since Love, Lust, Faith, and Dreams. It really, it, it, I guess it has been, but it doesn't seem like it's been four years. Yeah, I know. I feel the same way. We toured quite a bit for that album as well. Not you guys. Exactly. Like, we never tour. <laughs> we just kind of uh, do a couple of weeks and then come back home and take selfies by the pool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We love to be out on the road. And, I mean, the same thing is going to happen here. Uh, every time we do it, we say, you know, that was incredible. But maybe next time, not as much. I'm pretty sure we're going to end up back on the road again for a very long time. <laughs> um, but we're happy the song's finally out. Hey, Jared, where were you yesterday during the solar eclipse? Well, I was working, uh, rehearsing for the Music Video Awards, the MTV Awards in Los Angeles, California. And uh, we're doing something that really never been done before. So we're all excited, a little nervous to see what kind of reaction we get. That should be pretty cool looking. That's, you know, that's one of the great things about your band. You guys always try to do things a little bit different, make it an experience. I remember when uh, Love, Lust, Faith, and Dreams was coming out, you guys came through a few select cities. Chicago was one of them, and you did a show at the Chicago Cultural Center. It had that gigantic stained glass ceiling. It was just an amazing spot to pick to do a show. That's right. We did all those, uh, we called them Church of Mars. Right. Yeah, that was really cool. I forgot about that. Wow, that was an amazing show, an amazing day. Looking forward to this Sunday night, the MTV VMAs, uh, seeing this performance. Yeah, me too. We've been rehearsing nonstop. We're using some new technology to do something uh, really interesting, I think, um, but really difficult to pull off as well. So if it ends up being a wet fart in church, <laughs> uh, at, least, at least we tried. <laughs> and it's on MTV. And it's on MTV. Right. You know, I was just looking at the set list, you guys, from uh, from Camp Mars, which just wrapped up. I mean, you, it's, it's an amazing weekend for anybody who's in to 30 Seconds to Mars. It's three days, and you guys play each of the days, right? Yeah, it's our own little private uh, Lollapalooza in Malibu, California. We do it every year. It's a very limited amount of people. It, it's basically an adult summer camp. All the food and drink is included, and... We have, you know, yoga and meditation and archery and tie-dye class and then two shows on the Saturday and Sunday. But it's absolutely incredible. We're going to do one in Europe, I think, next year as well. Uh, and it's a lot of fun. That's awesome. You're going to take it over to Europe, too. That's, I mean, you guys are just worldwide, too, with your fans. I'm sure it's going to be just as well-received there. Yeah, we have a lot of... Uh, uh, support over overseas. We tour all over the planet. That's why the tours go on forever. We're, you know, from from Asia to Australia to Europe. Uh, we spend a lot of time overseas. Well, and because you guys tour so much, I think that goes hand in hand with having to do different things, like the Church of Mars shows, or trying to do something so different for the VMAs, just to keep it, if not for the fans, just for you guys to keep it fresh and always trying to do new stuff instead of just grabbing your guitar, getting back on stage, doing the same thing every single night. Yeah, exactly. And I think the new single, uh, Walk on Water, is going to be a lot of fun to play live. There's, We just put a gospel choir on it about three weeks ago, and uh, the song was built for the stage. Well, the new single's out today, Walk on Water, from 30 Seconds to Mars. And I know I know, Lou wants to ask you about the Joker. Oh, well, listen, i got to tell you, Jared, I think you did a fantastic job in Suicide Squad with that character. I just... Uh, I loved the way you approached it. I loved the way you did it. I thought it was uh, incredibly well done. And I'm hoping that it's going to happen, that you're going to come back as the Joker. Yeah, that would be really fun. I mean, I had a blast making the film. It's, you know, like I said before, the role of a lifetime. Just to have been able to bring that character uh, to life in my own way was, was a, a real, real adventure. So we'll see what happens. You know, they keep all these things uh, top secret. Uh, of course. But, uh, you know, I, I, it was definitely an experience that we'll forget, that's for sure. Now, the, the people attending Camp Mars, are they more 30 Seconds to Mars music fans, or are there some of them that are just there for the Joker and you? I think it's, it's pretty much a music-focused uh, weekend. But, I, you know, I think a lot of 30 Seconds to Mars fans probably enjoy the films that I make, too. And at this point, it's just like it's... It's a kind of an all-in-one deal. You get you get two for one here. That's a great uh, deal. <laughs> yeah, uh, and uh, yeah, that's how it works.
Well, Jared, we can't wait to get you guys back into Chicago. I'm hoping this uh, there's going to be some touring that comes through here. I'm sure there will be. And uh, when are we talking for the album? When do you think that's going to be out? I'm not sure yet, but it will be uh, sooner rather than later. I mean, we have finally a song done and out and shared with the world. Uh, and then we'll probably put out another song or two before the album comes. And this Sunday, MTV VMAs, you're going to do something pretty spectacular. You've teased it. We don't know exactly what it is, but it's... It's going to be pretty phenomenal. So uh, we're looking forward to Sunday night with you, Jared, and 30 Seconds to Mars. Thanks so much, guys. Yeah, keep your fingers crossed for us. I hope it goes well. Yeah. And, uh, you know, we're, we're really, really uh, excited that people are hearing new music finally and can't wait to get back to uh, Chicago where we've had such incredible concerts and to everyone out there listening, thank you so much for the support, passion, and we love you guys. We miss you, and we'll see you very soon. Brian and Lou. In the morning. How about we...